Sherelle, you are, like I said in the intro, such a, a, a brand all within yourself. What made you want to take your brand and take it and combine it with arms management? I just felt so touched by the vision and by the drive. Seeing another female entrepreneur, like just meeting Crystal through Destiny, I was just inspired because everything it is that she's doing right now has been a similar vision to what I've wanted to do with cruise control. So now just like sitting under her and having her as my manager, there's so much that she can pour into me. And then not only that, what intrigued me was that this was a kingdom based company, mm. like a kingdom based management, kingdom based people. So not only am I getting, you know, um, direction and having someone to protect me in the industry, but I'm also getting poured to poured into spiritually. So that's, that's it's it, and you know Destiny. We we worked on music in the, in the past few years, and also um, I had never really studied L. Butler's music. I knew that he was a Christian rapper in New York, but through Arms, I was able to it it, it kind of forced me to get into the mindset of where he was with his music. And then when I heard Matters of the Heart, which we're gonna dig into later, I just I became one with it because it started making me reflect on my matters of the heart and all things like that. So everything just kind of like came together and that's, that's just how it happened. That's amazing. You said something very powerful about having someone that will protect you. Um, because when you are artists, you need that individual that's going to look out for your best interest, because let's tell the truth. This industry is full of creeps and full of people. They so. Yeah that will try to take advantage of you. And so you need somebody that is going to be, you know, 10 toes down for you and be like, nah, you're not playing that with my artist. You're not playing. And Crystal is that individual. <laughs> <laughs> Learned you now. She is that person. And are we...